All right, here we go once again. We're still here. We still have patch 1.10, but this time, this time, we're going to be opening some packs. We have a scant, a meager 36,000 coffee to go through and some, some tears. Not as many tears. We got a lot of coffee, though. We're going to be opening a bunch of packs. We'll see what we get, see what excitement there is. But before we open some packs, got to let you know where that coffee came from. I'm part of the content affiliate team. That means the Phobies team does, in fact, give me coffee for producing Phobies content. So let's open some packs. All right, chat, let's see. Um, I do kind of wish that you could buy these offers with coffee. <laughs> I would strongly consider it rather than doing pack openings. But So we're just going to we'll go through all the tiers. There's only a few. As in, we'll do the one pack and one pack. Going forward, chat, I think we're going to do pack openings more frequently, just smaller. A little shove shark action. Nice, we get a level there. I'll uh, probably do pack openings more frequently. I want to try that for a few seasons. Because we used to do that back in the day. I would open it <clears throat> all the time, and then I just started saving up for each release. But people are always chomping at the bit, always pleading for me to do more pack openings, so... How many obtainable phobies missing? Uh, I th up until this, it was all ultra rares, I think. I don't remember how many. I have 155 phobies. You know it better than I do. Let's see what we got, chat. It's that easy, chat. Just open 36,000 coffee and you too will get one of the brand new phobies. <laughs> That's ace. That's ace. If you're watching this and didn't bother watching the other video, go check out my initial thoughts on Ace. If I remember, I'll put the thumbnail in there. I won't remember. Because I'm just going to be editing this quick. Thunder Rocks. Sabian! Yeah! Yeah! I don't know. It feels like that's a sound you would make. What do you think Sabian sounds like? Does it actually sound like a cymbal or does it sound like a chainsaw? I mean, a buzzsaw would be more appropriate, but I imagine this guy sounds like a chainsaw. <laughs> but we got two new phobies from the new patch, two uncommons under our belt. Let's keep it rolling, chat. What do we got here? All right. Got some Blasto upda upgrades, updates, whatever. A little Gonzo Bonzo action. Everybody's favorite hated four-cost mechanical. Microscopic recently buffed with the 1.10 patch. Little Brute Worst also buffed. Not, not a relevant buff. <laughs> not a relevant buff. You can see my thoughts on the on the balance update also in a different video go check out the channel subscribes all that fun stuff you've been if you're watching this you've been around youtube enough that you know how it works get a little will waffalo upgrade our favorite trash brute worst brute worst is quickly becoming one of my favorite phobies i have a soft spot for brute worst because he is so bad it it let's put it this way if the buff to bad sushi makes it playable brute worst is the new bad sushi and it might be worse than bad sushi, no matter what. Why are the food phobies so bad? Well, I can't say that. Cupcake and muffin are better. Cupcake and muffin are very playable. Are there any other food phobies? Corn. Corn's good. Dudful. Oh, we got some jar levels. Nice. Yeah, the food phobies are weird because... It, okay, so there's corn... Muffin, cupcake, brute worst, bad sushi. Don't tell me like sheep and gas. Yeah, I I know, I know. That doesn't count. Spud? Spud, okay. Spud is a reasonable one. Spud can go in that category. What do we got in the last one? Boom. Point one jackalope and drony. <laughs> unicorn. Yeah, we called unicorn out. What other food phobies are there? We should do a food phobie tier list. There's five. Little brute worst action. I'm going to point it out every time because 
Trivolta! This is this is actually sick, chat. So Trivolta, yet another phobie from the most recent patch. Let's dance. And this one's actually pretty cool. Like a spoiler for my other video. I'm pretty hyped for Trivolta. I do think that there's a lot of potential here. Trivolta seems pretty sick. I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. Would Dozer count as food? Mm, questionable. That's questionable. We, what are you talking about? We just got three new phobies, BBZ. We dreadfuls. Get out of here. We got three new phobies. What more do you want? Also, some uh, symbian levels. All right, what do we got here? Some more levels. Radiator levels. You'd love to see that. Radiator, one of my favorite phobies. Stabby action. The woolly bully. Not bad, not bad. Woolly bully feels underrated. Woolly bully, I think, is underrated. Cyclops, for some reason, coming up big in Monster of the Week because reasons. Well, little Finnegan action. Still got a lot more dreadfuls to go through, chat. Mechode, what's good? You missed our uh, patch breakdown. We're just getting through the pack opening now. Three of the new phobies in the bag. Let's see what we got. Shove Shark getting them levels. Interestingly enough, a phobie that doesn't necessarily need as many levels. <laughs> Dial. Or should I say mini Trivolta? Duo Volta? Does that work? I don't think that works. It doesn't roll off the tongue as well. Speaking of food phobies, you got Muffin and Cupcake. Minotaur also recently buffed. I didn't call that out in the last pack when we got it, but Minotaur got a buff. A little slammer head action. It's going to be Shark Week soon, chat. It's going to be Shark Week soon. Jackalopes also recently buffed. Has anybody seen whether the jackalopes are a thing now? I feel like even though with the buff, they're still not quite a thing, but there's hope. They still suck. You would be the expert, Mecco. You would know. <laughs> he goes, trust me. I feel like there were extensive, extensive experiments conducted. <laughs> Little flesh crawler. Now this might not suck. Flesh crawler also recently got a buff. Shout out to my flesh crawler fans. What do we got here? A little snot monster. I feel like Quagmire kind of fell off a cliff. As in, people don't really use it anymore. Not that he's bad. But Quagmire definitely was for a while. It was everywhere. It felt like every game there was a Quagmire. Significantly less snot monsters. The rusty action. This wasn't a recent buff, but uh, shout out to the rusty buff. Rusty moving up in the world. Cupcake. Gotta love the cupcake upgrade. Get rustied. That sounds weird. Yo! Next new phobie, we got Ash. Shout out to uh, all those with arachnophobia. Ash, friend in need. I don't know why the poison symbol looks a little different on here. I don't know why I feel like it looks different. I'm probably just imagining things. But anyway, Ash is pretty pretty sick. Talked about it in the video. Feels a little redundant with the existence of Shove Shark and Phantom. But I am excited to see where this guy shows up because of... The Graylian versus Miss Moffat relationship, where Graylian is like, well, why would I do Graylian instead of Miss Moffat or Octonauti? There are unique scenarios. I'm I'm pretty excited for this. Poison your friend in need. I don't. Sounds like the opposite of what they need. <laughs> it, it sounds like not what they're looking for. All right, what do we got? Some Phantom levels. I know there's people who love to see that. <laughs> Imagine if Phantom got longer range with levels. 
like the, the range grew with every level you got or something. That would be ridiculous. It'd be funny. Little oopsie baby? Yeah. Extra Henrietta levels? I guess they heard Ash was coming. For a second, I thought that was a new phobia. I was about to yell chat. I, for some reason, when it was exploding, it looked like it was going to pop up the word new, but no such luck. What do we got here? And we're getting a lot of levels for this guy, for Symbian. Primate number nine. All right, need some Noxious levels. The unofficial mascot until we get an undead T-Rex. Brute Worst. Can't be disappointed with Brute Worst. There's just no way. Can't be upset about that. <laughs> or can you? Brute Worst is officially the new bad sushi. Glob and uh, little zomboni, woolly bully, honey bear is just gross. Honey bear is just gross. Paddles, the original shove shark. A little germy action. All right. 600 damage jackalope? What level is that jackalope? It's gotta be like level 20, right? Zappy? Alright. The Ray Charger's action. Level 16, it has 600 damage already? Hmm. Their damage wasn't buffed, it was just the health and the, uh, the uh, combination bonus, right? Yo, Goon! That's a level for Goon, you love to see it. Level 14 Mopsy does 600. Interesting. All right, so we're getting some levels for Goon. Getting low on that coffee there, chat. Levels for Ash. Rocket Man, we're going to summon Luffy. I do need Poison Ivy levels because I really want to use Poison Ivy, but under leveled. Well, Cyclops. Benny! There we go. What are we up to? Five new phobies, chat? Four? Or is it five? It's four or five. But we got Benny. We got the new undead turret. I'm pretty excited about this guy. Uh, I, I really like Benny's design. But I'm more excited to just try him. Because I'm not sure about this guy. I'm honestly not sure what his role is going to be. I mean, he's obviously a turret. But... The big thing is, how difficult is it going to be for your opponent to kill him, kill the Resurrect? I'm not sure yet, so I really am excited to see where that goes. If you don't get Whiskers, these packs are dud full tier. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Hippie still lurking. Get a little Benny action. <laughs> You're behind. Like, are you on a delay? PBC. <laughs> All right, we get the stapler remover. Chat, you willed it into being. Chat was calling for whiskers. We got a little... Oh, my God. I never noticed on the art. Look at the art. Look at the art. Why? Like, is that... What is he wheeling? Is that a button? Or is that supposed to be like a landmine? I wonder if that's supposed to be like a landmine because he is a, a trap absorber. You think it's just supposed to be a manhole cover? Like his animation? Ooh, good point. Good point. When we were watching the trailer, I really thought he was going to have a teleport because of the way his animation went. Like, I really... Being burrow movement makes sense, but it's like... I was really hoping he had a teleport. <laughs> Where he could, like, teleport and burrow through to a different spot or something. Chad, I think we're ugh. I think we're back to only missing uh ultra rare phobies at this point. PVZ, are you are you seriously watching the, 
the stream on like a three minute delay. Like, <laughs> you're responding to everything two minutes after I already, like I say something, then somebody in chat corrects me or comments on it. Then I respond to the comment slash correction. And then you respond like two minutes after that. <laughs> So you're missing both my response and you're missing the chat response. <laughs> did I buy the event VIP? I did not this time around. Get a little kaboom action, some more goon. Yeah, BBZ, I think you're on a delay. <laughs> Attractor, everybody's favorite sentinel. All right, last scratch card for this pack and dreadfuls. Mr. Tramples. And yeah, we can do a terrifying, why not? We'll tack it on to the end, chat. Did pretty good. Can't complain too much. We got a bunch of the new phobies. And like I said, I'm pretty sure we're back to only needing ultra rares at this point. We only need ultra rares as far as I know in the collection. And of course, the uh, the usual stress phobies. That's all of the coffee spent. Well, there's 280. 84 coffee remaining 675 tiers and i got 1.4 million xp to burn through with a whole bunch of upgrades but like i said i'm going to try and do these pack openings more often going forward we'll see how things pan out but let me know what you thought let me know what you got in your packs did you get anything exciting from the new set or are you hoping for something in particular and you're saving up for your packs of your own that's going to do it for this one so as always everybody thank you for listening thank you for watching and tune in next time for more Random thoughts.